Welcome to the Black Excellence and Abundance channel. Melanin, the pigment that colors skin, eyes, and hair, could soon be the face of a new generation of bio-friendly electronic devices used in applications such as medical sensors and tissue stimulation treatments. A study published in the journal Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences for the first time gives remarkable insight into the electronical properties of melanin and its biologically compatible bioelectronic features. Semiconductors are arguably the most important modern-day high-tech material. They drive all modern electronics, said study co-author Professor Paul Meredith of the University of Queensland. The majority of semiconductors are made from inorganic elements or compounds such as silicone or gallium arsenide. Organic semiconductors, on the other hand, are a relatively new member of the semiconductor family and are composed of molecules containing carbon, hydrogen, and other elements. Co-author Ben Powell, an associate professor at the University of Queensland, said that in semiconductors such as those found in computers and mobile phones, electrons carry the electrical current. However, in biological systems such as brains and muscles, ions carry the current. We've now found that in melanin, both electrons and ions play important roles, the scientist said. The study points to a new way of interfacing conventional electronics to biological systems using a combination of ion and electron conducting biomaterials such as melanin. Melanin is able to talk to both electronic and ionic control security and hence can provide that connection role, said Professor Meredith about the study's findings, the culmination of 10 years of research and experiments. There are very few materials that meet these compatible bioelectronic requirements, and an insight into melanin's important biological functions and properties has been really crucial in this study. The team is currently working on creating ion-based electrical devices using melanin, with a view to ultimately connect them to actual biological systems. A critical area that one could foresee for bioelectronics is stimulating or repairing signal-carrying pathways in tissues such as muscle or brain, Professor Meredith concluded. Dr. Benjamin Fuchs is a registered pharmacist, nutritionalist, and skin care chemist for over 35 years. He is quoted as having said, Sight in biology means cell. Melanocyte is a cell that makes melanin. Melanin pigment is so unbelievable that it is now being used in computer chips because it has an ability to transduce electrical energy. Protonic energy. It's a fascination molecule, but all of this electrical energy makes it very powerful when it comes to the way cells divide. Fascination cell in the body, and that is the melanocyte. Did you know that melanin is the super absorber of all forms of energy? It has black hole properties. It absorbs toxins. It can convert light to sound and back again. It stores, transforms, and conducts energy. Melanin allows the growth of human beings to a spiritual consciousness and inner vision. Yes, folks, that thing that you have in your skin and throughout your body. Now it kind of makes sense why black people are so spiritual. Because we have that thing called melanin. In humans, melanin is the primary determinant of skin and hair color. However, few people know that melanin is found in almost every organ of the body and is necessary for the brain and nerves to operate, the eyes to see, and the cells to reproduce. I personally think that melanin is our superpower. Melanin is like vibranium, the fictional material in the movie The Black Panther. That's right, folks, melanin, that same thing on your body that gives you the color in your skin. The blacker the berry, the sweeter the juice. Numerous studies have shown that melanin aids in the human reproduction. Melanin causes younger looking skin. It has superior protection against the effects of ultraviolet radiation. 
And just think, many of us are old enough to remember when calling someone black was an insult. Just imagine that. If we only knew the power that we had in that blackness, the power in that melanin. The reality is that is a great compliment. And just think for a second. If melanin has this many uses, could you imagine the unlimited number of uses that melanin has? And I can't help but thinking about Henrietta Lacks and the healer cell. The healer cell was used in 1951, and it is projected that it's going to go on for as long as this society is in existence. The healer cell from 1951 is still helping people to this day. We have no idea how great this melanin is and the power that we have in our bodies. Amazing. Can you say black is beautiful? No matter how great we are or how great we think we are, we are way, way greater than we could ever imagine. Like James Brown said, Say it loud, I'm black and I'm proud. The Black Excellence and Abundance Channel, where black history is every day. We ask that you please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And remember, thou art.